After this video, you will only use the Leela Chess Zero Chess Engine. In this video, you will learn how many cores to allocate to Leela Chess Zero, how to apply the settings, how much memory cache to give, how it battles against Stockfish, end game values, network values, the best settings. But first, let's see how to download it. Open the Chrome search for Leela Chess Zero, go to the first website, click on Download, then go to Versions, scroll down and click on Assets, then download the Android version. After that, install it. Now, open Droidfish. Wait, 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 you don't have Droidfish? Shit. Open Chrome, search for Droidfish, go to the website, scroll down and download it install it and open the app. Now click on the top left corner, go to Manage Chess Engines, then select Engine and choose Leela Chess Zero, and done! Leela Chess Zero is now activated. Now let's move on to the best settings for Leela Chess Zero. Again, go to the menu bar, then Manage Chess Engines, and then Engine Options. If your device has a 4-core processor, copy and paste these settings. But if your device has an 8-core processor, copy these settings instead. Two tasks are done. Now it's time to battle it against the most powerful chess engine in the universe. So let's start the game. And if you're new to the channel, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. Now enjoy the game.